Hello. Last week the investigator received a new tab. Um, it is the experiment tab. Now what does it do? Well, we do have the WEC experiment and the multi experiment uh, in Adams. However, sometimes you might just want to run a quick and dirty experiment on a single data set with a single classifier. And for that purpose, you can use the experiment tab. So I'm just going to quickly load a data set. I want to run a cross validation one, um, 10 runs, 10 folds, and whatnot. I want to choose my linear regression on that, see how that performs. In terms of output, um, I want to have the root mean squared error, so that's fine. But I also want to have the relation coefficient as well. So I can then start that. And then I can see root mean squared error, how it changes over the 100 runs, and my correlation coefficient. And that's already it. Really, really simple. So what happens? It basically just saves the current data set on disk, creates an experiment behind the scenes, pushes that through the experimenter, and then obtains basically the results from there, and then outputs those. So really, really simple. And of course, as always, you can then also then just save that text output and do something else with that. But still, if you want to have um, a slightly uh, fancy output. So for instance, if we want to have as well the standard deviation, which is actually very important to see how much things vary. So if I then regenerate the outputs, then you can also see the standard deviation in each one of these. The nice thing is you don't have to re run things, you just reconfigure it. And of course, if you are doing these things more often, you can also then just add that to your setup and your favorites. Thank you.